I'm giving you a hall pass. A what? A what? A what? A week off from marriage. Watch us reel in the babes. What are you doing? Taking mental photographs from my spank bank. The first time I read it, I thought it was really funny. The thing that struck me is it had a lot of laughs, and it excited me. What if we had a massage parlor? Gentlemen, we're rub and tug with tea bag happy ending. Oh, no, no, no. I said uh, rub no tug. The, the tea bags, were, were, you heat those up. You don't know this stuff? We thought, wow, man, that is a high concept idea. With the Farrelly brothers, you're anticipating a certain amount of comedy that will catch you by surprise. Well, that's one of those things they don't tell you when you're young, huh? That you're still going to be jerking off after you get married? <laughs>It's not what you think happens. My character is kind of a suburban schlub. Are you guys sure this is the best place to meet hot, horny women at? Doesn't really kick in until about 9.30. I feel like he's a little more thoughtful in his use of the hall pass. Like, he's thinking, should I be doing this? And me, I'm just gung-ho. Like, Fred's just like, let's do it. It's just you and me, buddy, for the next six days. Let me log out. Okay, you log out. I'm going to try to bang a receptionist. Owen is really, really funny, and I think that's something that everybody knows about him, but he's also a really, really great actor. He's done a lot of stuff where he's Mr. Slick Guy. He's, he's a good-looking dude who gets the girl. But in his heart, Owen's a goofball. And I thought that would be the perfect guy to play here. I think it would be good for us to go out one night a week where it's just you and me. I think you it would be You've got to be helping. kidding me. What? You just checked out that girl's butt. Do you think she noticed? The best comedies are the comedies that come from the relatable human experience. I think Jason Sudeikis is such a great example because he has to do some of the wackiest stuff in this movie, but because you believe him, it's even funnier. You know what I love about divorcees? They love sex. Is that true? I don't know. I'd like to think so. You would like to think it was true. <laughs> it's been great working with Jason because he's very comfortable kind of coming up with stuff on the fly. What about the known correlation between floppy boobs and large mouth vaginas? Okay. You look down there, it's like, hey, I'm Billy Big Mouth Vagina. Home, home on the range. Christina was a no-brainer for us. We've been wanting to work with her for a long time. She is just phenomenal. The Farrelly's, they're wonderful. I feel really blessed to have uh, been asked to be a part of it. What the hell is wrong with you two? You are completely obsessed with sex. Honey, obsessed is a very strong word. Oh, yeah? This morning you left the computer on cockgobblers.com. I, I get my weather from that site. This has been the best film experience I've ever worked on. And it has everything to do with the fact that Peter and Bobby are so much fun to work with. We wanted to get a woman in that role that you really related to and that you really love dearly. And Jenna was just perfect for that. I occasionally notice other women, I'm sorry. Occasionally? Driving in a car with you is like being with a horny bobblehead. So we have a week off from marriage. We kind of need some help. Coakley comes in, who is a real ladies' man. That girl over there is looking at you. Well, it looks like Chief from Cuckoo's Nest. And he brings this life into our game. Paul Blonde, right here. She surrounds herself with less attractive women to make her look like a 10. Hot? Nah. That's amazing. You're like a beautiful mind. You watch these things and everybody talks about how much fun they have. I think it's bullshit most of the time. This time, for real, we had a great time making this movie. This really did feel like one of like, the best times, certainly, that I've had making a movie. We try to keep a, a fun set because if we're going somewhere for three months to shoot a movie, why aren't we having fun? Oh, I'm sorry to see that. If everybody's having a ball, then they'll take more chances, and that's what we're trying to do here. We're going to run my favorite play. It starts with a P and ends with an OC. Okay, what is it? <laughs>